43 years ago, Sheffield United joined the second division of the league and a year later were promoted to the first. Until last season, they had never left the Premier Division. Today, they are still a fine side and owe not a little to David Steele, the trainer coach. Footwork, headwork, tactics, he can teach and demonstrate any phase of the game. David was a Scottish international, has played for Huddersfield, captain to Preston North End and is as expert a coach as he was a player. Sheffield United skipper is Harry Gooney. A native of Sheffield, he joined the club when he was 14, working in the office until he was old enough to play for the team. He plays left half and has an exceptionally powerful throw in. Holmes is centre half and a fine pivot he is too. Takes his ball from any angle and can kick or head just where he wants to. Now Harry Hooper, right back. He came to the United in 1929 when he was only 18. Before playing football, he was a tailor's assistant, but decided he'd look better in vest and shorts than in one of his own made suits. Behind Harry is Michael McCarthy. He comes from Cork. And Sheffield supporters say that the journey was worth making because Michael has proved himself a fine custodian with a sure pair of hands. In the forward line is Harold Barton, outside right. A few years ago, he was a butcher boy until he joined Liverpool. He came to Sheffield only last June, but is already an established favourite. William Boyd is centre forward and another comparative newcomer. Bill comes from the other side of the Tweed. He played for Clyde and is, of course, very quick on the ball and a fine shot. Still another recent acquisition, Ephraim Dodds, the inside left. 18 years of age, he has such wonderful control of the ball that it seems tied on. He symbolises the spirit of youth that will keep the United flag flying at Bramhall Lane. 